Master Raven. Master Raven is more or less the same character, but with some nice improvements to her poking, punishment, and back turn gain. Raven's arguably best poke, 3-3, is even better now, with more damage and plus frames on hit. A faster transition into back turned also makes the synergy between poking and mix-ups more seamless and threatening than before. Speaking of which, Raven has also gained access to a Power Crush from Back Turned, which makes interrupting her Back Turned shenanigans even more risky. This doesn't alleviate the main weakness of Back Turned, which is Sidestep Left, but it's still a very useful tool in her arsenal. Perhaps the best buff, though, is that she now has two new 15 frame punishers Down Ford 443 and Ford 4 into Ford Ford 2 or a Rage Drive, which really helps her out in certain matchups. When it comes to nerfs, the most significant one is that Magic 4 doesn't give a combo anymore on its own. You have to commit to the 4 1. She also no longer gets a free down 3 after a back 1 at the wall, as you can now hold back after the knockdown to escape. But Raven can still force some powerful Okizeme. Also, her go to low from back turned, Ford 4 3, is now low parryable. When it comes to wall bounce moves, Raven's received two of them in Haze 1 plus 2 and Quarter Circle Forward 2 1, both of which are unfortunately quite mediocre. They're punishable on block, one being locked behind a stance, and the other being pretty slow. Though, if you do manage to land them, they can lead to some good damage. Overall, Master Raven is pretty much the same, but slightly stronger than before with her new 15 frame punishers, buffed 3 3, and Power Crush from Back Turned. She was definitely amongst the stronger characters in Season 1, and so remains a solid upper mid tier in Season 2. Commencing mission. <laughs> <laughs>